Hey everybody, Dana Stovern here with the Magic of Somatic Money, back for money message number 25. If you are here, either part or all of this message is important for you to be here and listen to. This is body-based money relationship doing e specific EQ money work to get you the messages at the time that you need them to be working on your money with your soft-sided money relationship skills. We're just going to go ahead, dive in, and start pulling cards. I think we've got a three-card pull today, so let's take a look at what Spirit World's got for us. Let me just shuffle one more time. Um, this one, Archangelic Realm, is coming in really solid. Okay. Whew. And not that card. This one. That's a, This is a secondary card. Okay. Card number, I just pulled card number two. I laid it down, didn't look at it. And, up. Oh, okay, so the card that I just popped on the floor, um, they want me to begin talking about that one first. It is the uh, money as, um, it's blueprint number one, money as ceremony, and I like to say ceremony. And this is building your safe, sacred money space. Um, they don't want me looking at the second card yet. What are we doing? Talking about sacred money? Nope, they want me to pull card number three. Okay. A little cryptic here today. Yeah, the cards, like, they're flying out of my hands, but they're not coming up when I... Oh, this one, this one, this one, this one. Okay, right, so we've got... Whew. <laughs> well, these go together. Okay. Um, and I'm going to pull the third one open. Wow, we're really in the um, magic money zone today. So um, I think I'm going to begin with this one. First one they wanted me to talk about, safe, sacred space with money. And then the other two is um, saging with money and then your modality with money. But All right, so let's take the three cards that I pulled. Um, let's take it from the top. And the top is... Safe, sacred space with money. This is blueprint number one. This would be about building out your safe, sacred space with money. And why is that important? Why, why is that not a fluffy thing? That's an important thing. Here's the deal. Money relationship is vulnerable. Yes, the majority of us sit down and just try and ka-chunk, 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 work out our numbers. That is a very masculine, logical, structural, way to do numbers and if you have challenges with that there's a reason for that because you're probably an eq money person you need to be doing your somatic money type look at the banner that i'm sending across and in knowing what your eq money type is you're going to find out how sensitive you are how you're working with your money do you have trauma engaged all these different things that can trigger off when you're working with your money so if you're working with your money and you don't feel safe you don't feel secure, then when you have vulnerable experiences with your money, it's gonna make it that much harder. That's why building out safe, sacred space is one of the most important things that you can do with your money relationship. So that's, that's for starters. Now, interesting, the safe, sacred space card is also coming with a choose your modality card and a saging card, both of which go with a safe sacred space card and here's why. If you're beginning to build out your safe sacred space with money, chances are you've got toxic energy, unclear energy, and you need to clear up energetically your space so you can feel better in it. So if you are watching this video, this money message video, you need to be paying attention to your sacred space. More specifically, it is time for you to do your saging work, clearing work, cleaning that, cleaning that space up. So that's for starters. Now, what's really interesting is that the third card that got pulled with this is the choose your modality card. And both the choose your modality and saging card, they're in blueprint number eight, which is more about integrating the magic of money into the structural aspects of money. So the choose your modality card is basically saying, hey, it is time for you to do some healing with your money, that EQ money aspect of your money, you need to be doing healing with it. So this might be where you're integrating Reiki into your money space or healing hands or you're doing breath work or you begin to work with a therapist about your 
um, EQ issues that are connected into money, or you could be doing tapping work, EFT work, like, I, like there's, there's a litany of all the different types of modality that you could plug in with money. And so this is just me standing in front of you today that it is time for you to consider what space that you are in with your money relationship, where you work your numbers, that's gonna be very important. And to begin to clean that up with some saging and then to pay attention to some healing work. So let me just tune in with Spirit Team and see if there's anything else that I need to be talking about here with this. Um, now they're saying that pretty much covers it. I, I can hear somebody in Spirit World say, Dana, what you're talking about for some folks out there, this is like a new way of looking at money, a new conceptual way of looking at money and, and the idea of putting a healing modality together with your money space. That's kind of a new idea for some of you. And so the spirit world wants you to know that this might just be a seed planting time um, a pay attention to it time, a consider this as a new idea and see how it might, you know, see how you might set it up for yourself for it to work in a way that, that works for you basically. But I can specifically hear somebody from Spirit World saying there are some people watching this ready to dismiss this. <laughs> and the people who are ready to dismiss this <laughs> There's like some wake up calls happening in your lifetime right now, in, in your life, you know, in your life path right now that you want to be paying attention to. And I am simply a messenger of maybe a new way or a new perspective of how you might want to go about doing things, especially with your money space. All right. So if you want to get your, um, if you want to get your hands on this deck, um, and begin to DIY your own somatic money practice. Uh, go to my link tree, the, the deck is there. I also have some free resources there uh, along with some low cost paid resources and I'm continuing to put these videos out. Please make sure to like, comment, follow, feel free to DM me and thanks for being here and I will see you in the next video.